a programmer for NASA. When I grew up, I wanted to build the world's fastest roller coaster. I attended the Leadership Shawnee Mission Program, and I was lucky enough to work with a welder named Loretta, and she taught me how to MIG properly. I didn't think I'd be able to get into something like this, you know? I don't really come from that side of the track, I guess. When I put something together and it looks nice, it is like the best feeling in the world. So Kimberly Hinkle from the CAA has like this really ugly little masterpiece thing I made with some scrap metal. But those welds were so nice, it, it makes you feel really good about yourself. You know, like, yeah, I did it. When this job's done, I really want to go see it in person and just say, hey, <laughs> I made that. Welding is so rewarding. I don't think I would be where I am now today but for Mr. Riley's class. When I grow up, I would like to be a firefighter. Since I was about four years old, that's what I've always wanted to do, is just be a firefighter. My grandpa was a firefighter and lost his life doing it. He passed away, he gave me some of his firefighter gear and equipment. If I wanted to take his commitment that he made to the fire service and put it in my own life and my own perspective and do what he did. Project Blue Eagle program started for me in eighth grade orientation. I met Mr. Morris, a very good store to me and a good person, and showed me how to do a lot of things. The Project Blue Eagle program is really something that I feel if I didn't do today, I don't know where I'd be in life. As a graduate of, of Shawnee Mission uh, School District, I got a lot of great leadership through uh, the Shawnee Mission West ROTC unit, and it's there. I don't think everybody uh, remembers their principal's name in grade school, but I do because of those experiences. When I grow up, I want to be an environmentalist. I think the first time I even heard of sustainability was the internship. Ever since my internship, I look at the way things are done differently, maybe by me being in it, and um, I can make a difference. And I asked my mom where all the frogs had gone, and she said, well, people have moved in and, and changed the environment. And as I got older uh, and I went to Shawnee Mission Northwest, I discovered that we had an environmental program. I really took this to heart. Uh, I kind of fell in love with that. So instead of going to Cancun my senior year with my friends, I stayed back behind to petition the council to allow us to burn the prairie biome. It ignited a passion in me to educate people about the importance of these biomes to our quality of life as humans. I want to be an art teacher. My third grade teacher was just a really inspiring person and she just really led me to wanting to be a teacher. I'm in a kindergarten classroom this year and they're just starting their journey while I'm a senior and I'm going to finish mine very soon. In the Shawnee Mission District I had so many teachers who went above and beyond to dream. Um, I had a lot of people when I was growing up try to talk me out of becoming a teacher. So I think this is the generation that will become the future. So I liked the idea that I could impact how that generation turned out. When I decided that I wanted to become a teacher, I decided I wanted to become a teacher in the Shawnee Mission School District with awesome kids. It was so exciting and I still wake up every day just so excited that I get to be here and teach in this district. Yeah. When I grow up, I want to be an actress. I did a, one of my first scenes in the drama class and, and I had ended up doing something to make people laugh and that just kind of gave me this joy. I, I was attracted to that and I think because, because of that I kept pursuing theater and now I'm almost at my uh, last show. I really believe that I went to one of the greatest high schools in the country and the world. Being at Shawnee Mission South, I got the opportunity to go to class every day with Mark Swayze who has been a lifelong mentor for me, as well as um, Kathy Wood. And that just solidified my love of being on stage and acting. Um, so grateful for the incredible education I got in the Shawnee Mission Schools. And I really, um, I really do think often and with a great deal of gratitude on the impact that the, the teachers and the quality of curriculum that I experienced had on my life. When I grow up, I want to be a nurse. What I love about this program is I'm able to learn about different procedures that happen in the hospital. I want to be able to connect with a patient one-on-one -on -one and be able to help them. And putting them before my needs is what I want to do the rest of my life. I was actually part of the health careers program at Shawnee Mission North. It was an amazing experience. 
I got to see so many things that I didn't even get to see in nursing school. Shadowing the nurses and seeing what they do really did help solidify that I wanted to be a nurse. Literature and reading and history, just being a well-rounded person has really helped me in my career. If you don't have good people skills, it's gonna be hard to make that heart connection with your patient. Being there when a new baby is born and when a family's being created are a really big privilege that I don't take lightly.